all right guys so uh here we are uh, we unloaded everything so we pretty much got the whole interior replaced not replaced but we got all the parts from the junkyard uh but it's this interior that we got is actually um in immaculate condition uh, it's palomino color but nothing is faded and look at the condition of these uh, you know b pillar trims it's amazing all these handles and um as you can see that uh switch right here uh now this door panel it's uh um pre facelift it's uh because it was from a car that was 1980 it was made in 1980 so it was a non-turbo so they had a little bit uh different switches um on the door panels later models they had different switches installed in them but still um everything is so beautiful and amazing so uh like i said guys keep keep hunting for parts keep saving these parts and keep collecting these parts all right and we got also amazing interior uh this is the rear seat all right so we got that as well it's in a great shape um and also this right there mm, uh, rear windshield amazing look at this this is this is literally a brand new horse hair for the seat that we found. Or well, not me, but he did, which is super cool. And it was just, you said some random website, huh? Yep. Yeah, it has all the names and everything. That is crazy. It's almost like a new old stock. That's amazing. But other than that, guys, check this out. Check this amazing garage. Check like the beautiful flooring this garage has all right we already brought this windshield here okay it's all safe and sound did nothing broke okay but that car is something else also it's a black on black 116 300 sd like i'll tell you what probably this is this is one of the rarest car of, cars i've ever seen and it's literally if you try to find another one like this it's not going to be easy but bought it from original owner so original owner what else T tell us the story tell us so, everything you know i was a personal chef of sylvester stallone oh. in, uh, hollywood so look at this interior like 277,000 miles that is insane like this thing is br like brand new literally look at look at the door handles you gotta yank like, those hard yeah there you go I'm brand new, but look at this. It's got power mirrors in the back too. Like this is like a new car, literally. Like look at the seats and everything, like nothing is worn out. It just needs some good leather conditioner for some lubrication for the leather. So the leather can stay brand new for another 100 years. But yeah, as you can see, like this car was really loved and like just judging like by the dash cover and everything and how pristine this thing is, like literally I have no words, guys. Take a look at the engine. Now th let's, let's go for some desserts, guys. Oh, wow. This is insane. New injectors. Yeah, new, new you engine. installed, right? You installed new yeah. injectors recently. Okay, what Hard else have lines. you done? Hard lines, injectors, a uh, couple gaskets. Mm-hmm super cool i see this is really fresh the brake cylinder or the master cylinder yeah that's awesome all it needs is a new battery yeah and uh these are original right or they these were replaced the no, engine these are lines? replaced replaced that's good that's really good uh, part of maintenance to replace these that's good stuff wow well huge respect to you for loving these amazing cars and literally i mean it's a wonderful ride yep i i cannot argue with that at all amazing beautiful machine all right so yeah he has some couple more parts right here but we're about to unload our cars because we brought some more because you know we're just that crazy let's go unload the cars my other friend is about to come over with his w208 and he needs this taillight so i got it for him today at the junkyard so he will be happy he should be here soon so yeah, should be a lot of fun tonight.
So, Alexei doesn't just like classic Mercedes or, and other cars, but he also loves gardening, which is so amazing. And he has all the organic stuff, everything from cucumbers to peppers, tomatoes, and even it's tobacco. Tobacco, look at that. Tobacco plant. That is insane. You roll up your cigars. <laughs> you roll up your cigars. Yeah. That's amazing. Hot peppers. Yeah. So hit him up if you guys need something, all right? It's this this stuff is awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna start a gardening channel. Yeah, you should. Yeah, if anything, he's he's trying to start a gardening channel. I mean that'd be awesome. I would love to see that. So if that ends up happening, I'll keep you guys updated. I'll let you know. So you guys can go and check out his channel. You know. Oh look at that. Strawberry. Ready. That's awesome. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Look at that guys. It's all from all homemade, all original, organic, whatever you want to call it. That's awesome. No pesticide. Yeah, no preservatives, none of that stuff. All right, friends, I'm about to start working on this amazing car. What, uh, what we have to do and accomplish tonight is we have to start it up. So we probably have to charge the battery or maybe get a new battery. We'll figure that out. And I want to go ahead and condition this leather. And we're probably going to work on a 123 and replace the rear seats on that car as well. So a couple tasks we have to do. Super exciting. Hope you guys enjoy. There he is, an amazing car. Yay. So here's the progress, slowly but surely. Start conditioning this. Um, I have to finish conditioning this part of the door panel, but it's coming along really nice. Um, and it's just really good protection for the interior and everything. And it's just a good idea to do all this at least once every week. So while I'm doing this, the owner is actually replacing the battery, uh, negative battery cable uh, post. Um, and yeah, that way later on, we'll actually also use that guy right there. You see it? What do you think that is? I'll let you think about that. And then we're going to do some more extra maintenance. Nice. Look at that, like brand new cable now. Don't touch them. <laughs> no, you could you could touch them, but just thank you, John. Uh, <laughs> yeah, free. Exactly. Look at that. Heavy duty. And it's nice. This one is red, so it will always remind you. Oh, this is red. Be careful. Achtung! Actually, Achtung! It's, it's the negative. Is that the? Ne yeah. Oh, that's right. So it's the other way around. Oh so my gosh. Yeah. Back. Yeah. Probably you should. Yeah. It's all right. Yeah. Or you will just have to look extra on the, you know, on the battery post. Make sure it's <laughs> positive. Which one's positive and which one's negative? Just double check. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's cool. So yeah. So next step is gonna be what? Just getting charging the battery or just getting another one? We're gonna get a new one because okay. I tried that one last night. Yep. So what? Uh, what happened? You were just like trying to crank it, right? I was cranking it 15 seconds at a time because I put the new injectors on, and then it was just I saw smoke come out of the battery. It yeah was so like what happened is that this post i think it was making a bad contact and it was arcing and since the starter is drawing a lot of current it was arcing and it actually caused this thing to melt all right and smoke a little bit it's not a big deal everything's fixed right now and yeah we're just probably gonna get a new battery is do you think that battery is old enough or oh, how? Yeah, it's ancient. oh yeah it's ancient he said <laughs> old one. yeah so let me show you what happened right here uh, with the old as you can see this is how melted it is right there on yeah, the other focus. side yep it's crazy right probably never seen that before but it happens mm -hmm. all right but now everything is good and yeah we just have to check the battery get a new one and uh install it and see if she cranks you know it's got a lot of new parts already the owner really gave it a lot of love new injectors a bunch of other things um yeah, I'm seeing some new coolant uh, hoses as well right there. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. it's an amazing car. Let's keep going. I've got to finish this interior and start this car. That's the task for tonight.
meant to copy those. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> a 123. I haven't driven as a passenger in 123 for a long time. That's awesome. Woohoo! This thing is a beauty. And everything works. Yeah, even the conditioning works, everything. Wow. Amazing machine. They don't they make them like they used to. Save your classic cars. car in the world, my favorite, number one, W123. All right guys, we just arrived at Costco. We're gonna see if they have, if it's open. If it's open, we're gonna try to get a battery for this uh, W116. Um, if not, then we'll have to check a couple other stores to see if uh, we can find a battery for that bad boy. So we can start it tonight. For this? For this one, yeah. Turkey. Oh yeah, Turkey sells a lot of so you like they sell the set of door seals in, from Turkey for like 120 bucks, which is not bad at all. It's you know? not bad, but it also doesn't fit. Yeah, so I mean there's yeah, there's some stuff you have to work with it, but you know on that 240D, the red one, I actually installed the Euro seals on it and they work Euro, pretty good. Euro actually fits the yeah, best, the other best. Than original Mercedes. Okay. So you had experience with Turkish seals yeah, for these 123s? They're way too big. Like too big, right? Bunch of gotcha. Meat. Gotcha. So, I know that about the Euro. They like them big, huh? That's oh, what yeah. she said. <laughs> <laughs> Not as big as Russian ones. Oh yeah. Ooh Shots fired, shots fired. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'm loving the sunroof here. That's awesome. That's all you need just like for a nice cruise, just amazing 123, just drive around, enjoy some, you know, easy, relaxing music, and that's all you need in life. Classic Mercedes. I used to live right here. Sweet, nice. How long time ago? Not About four months ago. Four months ago, nice. Yeah. How did you like? Oh no, wait, look at this. Woo! It was. Oh, it's an old guy driving it, yeah. It was a super minimalist lifestyle. It was a, a room in a yeah. townhouse. Yeah. Gotcha. I saved a bunch of money. I was like 600 bucks. Oh, okay. The rent? Yeah. That's not too bad. That's uh, good. Absolutely. Awesome. Yeah, I'm loving everything. Like, see, this is like the perfect weather, like I said. Like, not too hot, not too cold for me. Like, because I just can't, I just can't. You know, look, look at this stuff. Like, I'm burnt. My skin doesn't like it. My skin's like, where's the rain at? The you were just, you were just in Washington and I, I, I was loving all the rain. And what happened now? I don't see any rain. <laughs> the skin is mad at me now. Yeah. All right, guys. We arrived at AutoZone because, you know, we're, we're, we're not that fast, you know. Costco's closed. Costco's closed, exactly. There you go. But, you know, AutoZone is going to probably help us out this time. Woohoo. Yep, I got the battery. Let me just put this stupid mask on. But I can't do it with one hand. Woo. <laughs> we're, we're good kids. We're good. <laughs> we're, we're turning our oil. We're turning our oil. Now we recycle it properly, you know? Yeah. This one is. Come on. I'm not. Alright, guys, we got yourself ourselves the battery and some fluid film, some other stuff, and we're ready to go and save that car. Save a day. All right, so Alexei, he has a lot of other parts that he showed me, and um, this is not just one of those things that he has. He has a lot more, so he's about to open this and show you some goodies that he has right here. Um, Look at that. So he has everything, fuel lines, wheel bearing grease, woohoo, Mercedes. He has some new control arms, original Mercedes control arms and tie rods and just a bunch of extra stuff right here oils fluids anything you can think of 
amazing it's so nicely organized and i like how this caliper is chilling chilling here it's cool <laughs> ready to be ready ready, ready yeah <laughs> that's awesome